Hi everybody, it's Lou Manfredini, ACES Home Expert, and I have a little herb garden project for you that I think is a, a, a really nice idea, especially if you live in a smaller area, maybe an apartment or townhome, and you'd like to grow some of your own herbs. Now, if you head to the garden center or you head to even your local ACE that does plants, you'll find all kinds of herbs, whether it's oregano, thyme, this is actually lavender, which is really nice. And the issue is, let's say you live in an apartment, you don't have any uh, space to do anything. We're gonna help you create your own little herb garden using some plumbing fittings and a piece of wood. Now this is just a regular piece of two by four. And if you want, you can go ahead and stain that uh, to protect the wood. You can keep it natural if you want. It's gonna last just, uh, it's gonna do just fine for you. Um, and you're going to, um, you're going to take these fittings and you can either use them as they are or you can spray paint them. Uh, I've got some spray paint here, red, white, and blue, and we've already uh, spray painted a couple over here, but what you want to do is take some of that paint and uh, go ahead and shake it up. And then I'm going to go ahead, you see I have one that's already blue, and I'm going to go ahead here and spray one on red. Now make sure you're doing this in a well-ventilated area. You don't want to... Um, uh, breathe all these fumes so hopefully you do this outside we're in a store setting here we have the doors open and we're going to make it really quick now when it comes to spray painting you want to make it quick back and forth back and forth red will cover pretty quickly and you're just looking for a little bit of coverage all the way around and uh, moving around back and forth i'm going to come out and slide over here so i get all the sides and the nice thing about spray paint is it dries pretty quickly um, so once you spray paint all this um, you know, it's really only going to be a matter of, I don't know, 10 minutes or so that this is going to dry. This blue I did about 10 minutes ago, this white I covered uh, with um, some white paint as well, and that red is going to go ahead and dry. Now, what I'm going to do is take some glue like this. This is a heavy-duty glue by Loctite. It's actually called Power Grab. And what's unique about this particular uh, glue is that you can apply it to different things and it will hold in place. They even have a video where you can uh, take it and um, you put a brick and stick it on a wall and it actually does work. So you're gonna take these fittings, I'll take this blue fitting that I've already done just to illustrate what we're gonna do because I have one that's already done, sort of like a cooking show. And I'm gonna take this glue on this bottom edge that I didn't spray paint and I'm gonna put a nice bead of glue right across the edge of this with the caulk gun, okay? Because this is gonna give me what it's gonna stick. And you're gonna go all the way around, okay? Nice fitting like that, put it on there. This is sticky, okay? I'm gonna take that on that, I'm gonna push it on and squeeze it. Need a little bit of pressure, but it actually holds, watch this. Isn't that cool? Now, you're gonna to wanna to let that dry. What I'm gonna also tell you to do is on this particular one, go ahead and take this almost like you're caulking and come around it and put a little bead on there all the way around to get a nice connection between the fitting and the, and the wood so that it, it dries, okay? And you're gonna come all the way around on all the fittings. Now I mentioned it was like a cooking show. Stay right there with your camera. I've already done all these in red, white, and blue, okay? The whole idea behind this is when I'm done, I can lean this up, say on your balcony uh, in your uh, apartment or near a window inside the home. And with this on an angle, we can go ahead and take the different herbs, okay, out of the pots and place them inside of here, okay, as, as the place you're gonna, you're gonna move this in. Now this you're gonna compact all the way into the pipe Okay, all the way in. You may have to remove a little bit of the dirt to get them to fit, but this is this should be a pretty good fit here. You can squeeze these in there. And the nice thing about the herbs is by, by adding that into this and pushing it all the way down inside there, when you're done, get it all the way down inside there, you'll be able to stand that up on a wall like this and keep it watered. Now, two schools of thought. You could drill a hole in there for drainage, but because it's so tight and compact with, with this, I would tend to say not to do that. Let it hold a little bit of water. The wood itself will absorb some of the water and you've created your own little herb garden, a little project like that, easy to do. And what's really nice about that, especially in a small area, 
you have all these wonderful scents that come from these herbs. If you'd like us to try another project, just put a notation at the bottom of this video. And remember, ACE is the helpful place. Mm -hmm.